Word. What up? Oh. What up? How's life, Steven? Yeah, it's not too bad. A little tired, but yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's, that's, nice. that's a grind. Alright, talk to me about this match, what I missed. Alright, so far, it's game one. Yep. Fire Blaster versus Zoso. It's Mario versus Marsh. So, um, we're about to watch some body mint. Um, yeah, uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll see, okay. Hey, I don't know if you, if you saw uh, the uh, Smash Summit 2. Remember, Scorpidor. Okay, that, you that, know? that is 100% correct. However, uh, the man that's sitting down at the setup is not Scorpidor. Yeah. <laughs> There's he, nothing Scorp or Dorp about it. He is. He, he does have a very fantastic Mario, though. Is is Javi the man? Absolutely. Is he the Scorpion Master? Not even close. Man, I remember watching that tournament live when he first started playing, like the Scorpidor. Oh, where, where that happened? The, the young he, Scorpion Master. The young God Scorp Scorpion Master. Yeah. And that was during the time where they didn't really use player cams. Yeah. So no one was, you know. So no one knew who it was. Outside of the people like at the tournament and like, you know, the insiders and shit like that. So and there was no Twitter, there was no, there was no you didn't find out until like the post tournament thread at at, uh, at the on, on Smashboard. Yeah. And people were like, wait, who the hell is this Scorpio? Why do you play so high? Like, oh yo, that's he actually, I think he won that tournament. Did he win? I yeah. oh my god. He went, who is the Scorpion Nest? He went Mario the entire tournament. Yeah, That's it, was, it was nuts. And I thought that was like the greatest thing in my life. And I was like, <laughs> who is this Mario player out of nowhere? It's kind of like with uh, Falco Master 3000, except it was better. Mario. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But yeah, um, got a four stock going on. Yep, it's happening. It's it's a very unfortunate matchup for Mario. Yeah. Obviously, Mario. Ooh, definitely a uh, smart edge guard. Mario has Mario. these little, these tiny hands and these tiny little legs, <laughs> and Marth has his gigantic sword. That Fucking sword as big as Mario. Exactly. A nice double dip. Style on style. Winner semis. Yeah, I believe. Yeah, winner semis. Thanks. Winner semis. Silver and um, Swift for the other half. Winner semis. Silver yep. one or silver lost that one. Nice turnout. Yeah. Compared yeah. to last time, because remember, there's only like. Time. Shh, shh, we're not talking about it. We're not there's talking like a about dozen it. or something. No, no, stop it. Stop it. Hey, if you're watching the stream, tell your friends to watch the stream. Okay. Everybody but, smash uh, character slash switch stream. from Mario to Jigglypuff. Oh, man, we're going to be here all night up, now. Jumping up the tier list to So he <laughs> we're a couple spots, more than twice <laughs> jumping up in spots. Uh, so, fun fact Javier, uh, like myself, has no problem playing lame and is willing to do whatever it takes to get the W. And so we're now going to witness eight minutes of Hungry Box Jr., ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Actually, he's a little more aggressive than Hungry Box, because there's no way Hungry Box would be all up in his shit right now. I don't really know the matchup, at least on, on paper, what it is. I think Marth has the better. It is, it's like 55-45 Marth. Yeah, like like it's, like it's in Marth's favor, but it's not like, oh my god. It's this not like God -like. Bowser or Sheik. It's just like, you know, a matchup of top tiers. Yeah. What can you do? Tipper kill. <laughs> Bowser or Sheik. It just, yeah. just registered that you said that. No matchup is that bad in any Smash game. I know some people who, like, like uh, Mooney, Ian Mooney, Eichelman, no. for those who don't know. Cash Mooney. For those I, who he's actually did. really good at that matchup as Bowser. Really? Yeah. No. It, I it, would it, love it, to see that because is that uh, I I find it difficult to believe, and that's no shade on Eichelman whatsoever. <laughs> but that is that is rough. Yeah. No. Like, it what is. do you have? What can you even do? Like oh. even even in PM, it's ninety ten, <laughs> but it's not a it's not a hundred zip like it is in Melee. <laughs> Melee is literally unplug your controller, dog. There is nothing that can be done, so I would love to see that. I'm gonna YouTube that when I get home. To see like what what is there? Please, Eichelman, show us your secrets. Also, we probably come hit this game. Yeah, Ooh, yeah. yeah. Um, went for the shield breaker. You're not cool. So Javier's last stock was another tipper, but it was at I think a little bit lower percent. It was probably it was like right around oh, like 70 nice when before he got hit. I do wonder if that was intentional just now, getting hit by the top of up B so that Marth couldn't touch stage. 
Oh. It's a fun thing I like to do against foxes is I'll jump in the way of Firefox so that the directory stops, they just fall and die. I'll take like, what, 10% and I've died from it a couple times, but it's always worth it. Optimal? No. Go. That same exact uh, scenario last the stock before. So what, you got DI up, right? So that you don't get hit by the tipper? Yeah. Or yeah, so DI, DI the throws up. Where is it? In? I for oh, always forget. Cause, cause I feel like DIing in against someone with a disoriented hitbox is just a bad call. Or yeah. against Falcon. If you, get hit the, <laughs> if you hit the center of the blade, you're not going to die instantly. Exactly. <laughs> okay, no, I, okay, I see your point. But I feel like DIing up, you're going to miss the blade entirely. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, why, why get not hit? Not getting hit is better than yes. getting hit. And that was I think he tried right. DIing up and died. Yeah. Very hard. All right, we're going to get Gildo and HAL 9000 on stream next.